Good evening folks, Mark Duhari here and welcome back to another episode of Dawn of Man and thanks to everyone who'd hit the subscribe button since you like these videos so I will be continuing so remember if you like this content feel free to hit the thumbs up button and leave me a little comment if you didn't like it you can use the thumbs down button but then please let me know in the comment section what you didn't like so I know how I can improve and feel free to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell that way you will get notified when I post new content to the channel but yeah let's continue where we left off the last time and and see where we can go in this episode. New animal has been all oh, the pigs, man. All the pigs again. I did set limits on the pigs, didn't I? 15. Yeah, 21. Uh, 18. Carts is still an issue. Why are they not making any more carts? I think probably they are... I think he's trying to get the uh, the sledges before he gets the carts. Yeah, see? Let's try to get the carts up. I need carts for six donkeys. There you go, Adam. That's the way to do it. Uh, so there's, there is no way to prioritize this auto production. So I think they were trying to make the sledges because it's first in line. Sledges until 50% of my population, which would be 41. So I currently have 30, which means they would make an 11 sledges before they would make the, the carts. I think that's how it works. Straw production. I am currently uh, 62 straw left, but they will be harvesting this soonish. So... Yeah, I think I can still upgrade a few things. Wait, is that one now upgraded? Yes, it is. Let me upgrade the storage houses first. Uh, storage. Beer in Bruges was amazing. Beer in Belgium is always amazing. Especially if you take Belgian beers. We probably have the best beer in the world, although... The people from Carlsberg will try to convince you they have the best beer in the world and the people from Holland, from the Netherlands will try to convince you they have the best beer in the world but both have the best beer public creation section of the world. They don't have the best beer. When we talk about uh, Heineken, which is the Dutch beer in Belgium, it is called as cat pee with foam. But they have way better marketing than the Belgians. Way better marketing. Belgians are too... How do they call it? Um, I don't know how it's called. I would have to look up the word. And I can't even remember the word, the word in Dutch. Best waffles? Yeah. Best beers, best waffles. And best fries. Although the French tried to convince you, convince you it's French fries. No, it's not. Fries is a Belgian product. But uh, you guys had the awkward uh, idea of naming fries after the cook who brought it to you. The cook was a French guy. The product is Belgian. See, us Belgians, we, uh, we don't brag with our products. And that's a big problem. We are... Uh, hum yeah, humble. Exactly. Belgians are humble. We have great things, but we never say we have great things. I'm trying to change that. With beers, waffles, french fries. Man, the village is already big. It's still working out okay without fences. And I'm pretty sure the developers <laughs> will change that at some, at some point. Oh, fries with mayonnaise. And stofflies, man. Stofli sauce. Uh, what's it called in, in English? In English, uh, you would call it stew. It's beef stew. And it has a, a brown sauce in which we, of course, add some Belgian beers. You add the beers to the sauce. Oh, man. We've had fries today with... Uh, not with uh, stew. Is it with something else? Oh, not a trader. Man, traders seem to like me. One day you're gonna get on and get wiped is what you are saying. Nope, Toasty Gaming. I played through uh, hardcore 
with uh, this setup and I'm serious if you will see the videos check if you go to my YouTube channel check season 4 of this um, game you will see that I am going through hardcore in the Northlands so the cold area without any fences and I played through the end unlocked every technology and unlocked every milestone without having a single wall and a single gate it was a suggestion made by one person from the stream and it's working out great in Canada they have fries with cheese and gravy it's called put, put, putin. putin putin in Ireland is something completely on it is putin Okay, well, yeah, gravy. Gravy is actually, if I if I understand it correctly, gravy is actually the butter sauce you have left over when you bake or cook a steak. I think that's the gravy. It's the 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 oil oil left over from the butter. I think that's what what gravy is. If I'm not correct, please correct me. But the stew sauce is not like that. It's actually a stew. And they take the sauce from the stew and they add that to the french fries. With all the beer talk, I, w I now want the Rochefort 10. Ah, oh, Rochefort 10. I don't know if, if, if that will be... A I don't think it, the beer I will mention is available in, in foreign countries. But if you ever can get your hands on uh, things like West Vleteren, it will be very difficult to get in other countries. It's even difficult to get in Belgium, West Vleteren. And St. Bernardus upped those two beers delicious strong dark beers but strong beers i mean the saint bernardus is like if i'm correct 12 12 degrees abv something like that that one is good yeah gravy is dripping leftovers from cooked yeah yeah exactly sucks it's the the butter sauce you have left which is not the same thing as the the stew sauce i, I we have in belgium but with cheese on and yeah, gra gravy. Mm. I might try that actually. I would. I would try that. I would try that. Okay, this is being upgraded, which is fine. Can I upgrade these? Not yet. We are in winter, which means I probably could upgrade a couple more. I have the resources, so why not? Well, I don't have a lot of wood left. Oh, all the wood is gone. All the wood is gone. Hmm. Come to Montreal. Yep, that's the French part of Canada, isn't it? I'd love to. I'd love to. It's... I mean, I would, I would say on the planning, but it isn't on the planning, but it's one thing I would like to visit. Canada, the United States for uh, the... The Kentucky Bourbon Trail. I'm a, a big whiskey fan, so I would like to do that. Canada is on the planning. I would go to. Like, I would love to go to South Africa as well. There are a few. I would go, love to go to the Scandinavian part, especially Finland, to go visit Reto and bring some whiskey. <laughs> so, guys, uh, five more mi minutes to enter the giveaway! Exclamation mark! Dawn of Man will enter you into the giveaway. And you have the chance to win a key to this fabulous game. Great game. Loving it. Been playing it for a couple of months now. From the earlier betas, I think. It must have been a, it's a couple of months already. Yeah, must, must be. New humans are born. I have 10 points unlocked. Which means... Horse domestication, of course. Oh, look, the cards are coming up, which is fine. So that means this guy is trying to do its thing. But he needs letters. Let me check the, the limits on hide. I need more of these because I need those to make the cards and the and the other things acquired this trader has arrived perfect what are you bringing he's average mr average guy is bringing me bows again he's bringing beer that's 49 man that's expensive man 
I'm gonna skip it for now. Should not do that, but I'm gonna skip it. The wood production. Hold on a second. There is probably some wood production. There's two tannins up here. I don't need that too. Sticks. Mud. Fish. More mud. It's more fish. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This one needs to move. Let's... Uh, Wait, this is the tannin, isn't it? No. Like this. Donkey on horses on the other side of the river. Not up here. Ooh. Yeah, let's do it. Ebex is up there. Horses up here. <sighs> Wild horses. What's this? It's a bison? Yeah. Let's get the horses. Adam, you can only enter once. No worries. Once you have received your ticket, you are in the competition. You are in already, Adam. I think you are. Let me check. Lassie. Yeah, Adam. You are in. 22 people in the competition. New human has been born. I got these. I got that, which is perfect. Sledges are no longer... Yeah, my sledges will, will break. New human has been born. 88 people out of the 98 I can host. We are in summer, which means I can probably upgrade a few more houses if I wanted to. Did they finish this one? Yes, they did. You. You can make those now. And then maybe I should add in another um, workshop thingy. Oh, look, the first donkey with a cart. Fur carts. Uh, bronze bears. New humans are joining. I'm at 95 people. The last uh, achievement milestone is actually the goal is to have 150 people and 30 roundhouses. Yep, I have three horses already. There are probably a few more. Yeah, those are the adult ones. I'm not touching those. Not touching those. This guy is going to... I don't know where. He's going to drink. He's thirsty. Oh, you know what? Um, maybe I should add... Build. Production. A water well up here. That way the miners don't have to walk all over the mountain to get to the water. Might work. Might not work. It works. How many cow do I have? Not a lot. Get the little ones. Kill the big ones. Carts are going up. Four of them. What's the status on unlocks? Well, let's unlock this one. And then we can pick the winner. Yeah, I know, but Urks, they are attacking. I don't care. It's gonna be summer soon. Oh, it is summer. It is still summer. Yeah, I shouldn't do anything now building-wise. Because it's gonna be harvesting season pretty soon. Train has arrived. An average... Oh, he's still bringing in this? I don't have anything worth trading with him what's this seven so I give if I give away ten that would be seventy let's try hmm seventy one forty like 
that. Got one point from the other well I built up there. Actually, is there a well? No, there is none. Normally I try to place a well in the center of my area. My living quarters. Oh, I can't. I have no... Uh, like this. Arrex attack. New animal has been born. Donkey. Bronze knives. Sickles. New cattle have been born. Three more points and then I'm closing the giveaway and picking a winner. That's another point. Two points to go. So if you still want to enter the competition, the giveaway, uh, let, uh, just use the exclamation mark Dawn of Man with an A and you will be entered into the pool of now 22 people who would like to have a copy of this game. A uh, new human has been born. One more point. Oh no, no, that's not the one I wanted. Oh, welfare is at 99%. Look at that, people. I wonder what would happen if you reach a, a thousand before you finish the game. I mean, before you finish the tech tree and stuff like that. He did play it on his channel? I don't know, Snowman. I know... Uh, who was playing? I think... It might have been Zuljan, yeah. It might have been Zuljan or it was John Bain. I don't know for sure. I don't know for sure. One more point and then I'm closing the giveaway. Uh, it's now fall. I think they finished harvesting. So I should be able to upgrade a few more houses. Should I upgrade? No, this one is already upgraded actually. This I cannot upgrade, this I cannot upgrade, this is also storage, so upgrade this one, upgrade this one, and upgrade this one. You follow a lot of the same streamers? Yeah, probably. It's because I like, I've always uh, liked uh, Zuljan's approach to things. Like, he's playing games other people will not I won't say will not touch, but will not feature on their on their channel, and I like that. That's how I discover new games. And John Bain, I just love John Bain. I just love John Bain. Drax is fun as well. <laughs> I like seeing those two together. And I like the, what he's trying to do with with the podcasting. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. <clears throat> if my English was better, I would have done it. But I'm already in a in. Well, we are doing a podcast in Dutch, maybe a little publicity for a podcast, which is called Tech 45. It's a podcast we have been running for, uh, hmm, I think it's now seven to eight years. We are here in Belgium and the Netherlands, once one of the more popular tech related podcasts. It's a weekly podcast where we kind of talk about the, the tech news of this week in Dutch, of course, Flemish, Belgian people and a few Dutch people. And yeah, it's doing okay. We are, it's not like US style where we make uh, millions of dollars out of that. Actually, we, we, we don't make any money out of that. It's a, something we do on the side. In Belgium, we speak a couple of languages. Um, I think, I would say 60%, let's say 50% speaks French. 50% speaks Dutch, although there are more people speaking Dutch, uh, Flemish actually, which is a dialect from Dutch. Uh, there are a lot more Dutch speaking people than French speaking people. And there is a little part of the country where we speak German. So we have the three national languages are Dutch, French and German. And of course, yeah, we try to speak English as well. My English is very good. Thank you for that. I tried. I tried to do my best. My English is decent enough. I have a funny little accent, but I don't care. I knew French and German, but never knew Dutch. Well, it's we call it uh, uh, Flemish. It's it's the same language as Dutch, but uh, we have a few words which are different. It's not a dialect. Let's call it not a dialect. It's like the French in Quebec will be slightly different to the French in France. It's like the the, the Dutch in the Netherlands is different to the Dutch in uh, South Africa, for example. 
Your English is better than mine. Yeah. Thank you. One more point, guys. I need one more point. And then I'm going to be uh, pausing the game for a bit so we can close up the, the competition thingy, the giveaway thingy. Uh, yeah, I will need to be able to uh, get in touch with you through whatever, Discord, uh, Steam is also a possibility, maybe a private message on Twitch if that's possible, or on YouTube, but I need to be able to reach you to give you the key actually. What's a point? You have a point. You, uh, what's a point? Yeah. I don't know how, maybe that's a typical saying <laughs> for me. You made a point, uh, I think. You made a point. I don't know. I don't know how to, tra <laughs> if that's not the correct word, then I don't know. Ro oh, there we go. We have our meat. We have our 10 points. We can unlock the last thing we have here, which is the bow making. I'm going to be turning that on really quick and then we can check. Turn this off, turn this on. And turn this on. And then turn... No, I don't have anything. Okay. But I think we are getting to the end of this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up button and leave me a little comment. If you didn't like it, feel free to press the thumbs down button. But let me know in the comment section what you didn't like so I know what to improve for the next uh, episode. And check the description for links to social media pages, links on ways to support me, a link to our Discord server where you can hop on and have a chat with us, and also a link to the Twitch channel where I'm streaming this game and a few other games as well. So go check those out as well. And while you're on YouTube page, feel free to subscribe and hit the notification bell not only do you help me reach my next subscriber goal but you will also get notified when i post new content to the channel and that being said i'm gonna be wrapping up today's episode so until next time have fun and stay safe bye bye